Hi, talking about my uh, smart app which is connected to the power mister inverter and battery system. Basically I'm going in to uh, delve in into home storage and my home storage battery is connected to this uh, app so I can see the readout. Earlier on today if I look into the charts you can see that I discharge in the yellow a rice cooker so I was cooking breakfast and now it's charging uh, to uh, this orange and it stopped charging now so it's basically um, just trickling energy through to the battery. Uh, I could actually offset it by charging more but as you can see it's 100% and it can't go over and the solar at the moment is 1.25 kilowatts uh, it's using at the moment 40 watts and there's the um, specs here as well but uh, yeah if you can see in the corner this is my 5 kilowatt battery and it's temporarily here because I haven't fixed it to the wall. I haven't put any uh, insulation and whatever onto this, so I've yet to do that. But as you can see, this is the main problem of mine. I had trouble shooting this. Basically, this Wi-Fi module wasn't connecting. This fourth light here wasn't showing you that it was connected to the internet. And for this, I had problems and I had to ring or I had to contact the uh, seller about this particular problem. Anyway, I got it fixed, I fixed it myself. And the main problem was I was using, you can see this, this Deco Wi-Fi mesh system. Basically this mesh system is supposed to be backwards compatible, uh, especially to my Wi-Fi module for the power mister, but it didn't work. Instead, the fix was to use this uh, Wi-Fi repeater. If I was to use this as a Wi-Fi repeater, it wouldn't give me the uh, router um, address to make this compatible with the PowerMister system. Instead, I had to configure this as a mini router and the internet coming from this Ethernet via this lead and then the output of that is through the um, mesh system so basically this is acting as the internet going into this lead and this pixel link is now connected and is representing a router which is compatible with my uh, power mister wi-fi module uh, another problem I also had is the SSID. If you can see, this is a PixLink uh, plug, which SSID is labelled uh, PixLink 2.4 gigahertz. I couldn't customise it to whatever name I wanted to because it wouldn't recognise it and it wouldn't uh, work with the PowerMister Wi-Fi module. So I had to keep the original PixLink uh, SSID name and it works perfectly now but um, the uh, password I can change so I used a different password but the SSID name is of the original name for, th for this plug uh, if you was to um, do something similar where your Wi-Fi doesn't work with the um, uh, Power Mister Wi-Fi module, then you'll probably need to do something similar. Just buy yourself a plug, connect it to the internet with the um, lead, and then keep the original SSID name and change your password for this. And hopefully, this should work. Uh, this is a simple fix and it seems to be working perfectly as you can see as you go into 
the system I can now see um, the output on my phone and hopefully I can uh, see this there is a slight delay I can say that um, whatever starting there I would see this at least uh, three to four minutes later on on the app so it's not like quick but at least it's um, possible that I can see um, the status of this battery uh, at least three minutes later but you know anything's better than nothing and now I can uh, with ease see the readout anyway I hope this helps you to uh, solve any Wi-Fi problems with your power mister and like and subscribe to, to my channel for any more uh, tutorials and uh, explanations on certain technologies and I'll talk to you later cheers bye